My name is Michael Kamorn. I'm an attorney out of Southfield. I'm also the president of the Michigan Medical Marijuana Association, which is a nonprofit patient advocacy group with about 25,000 members. Um, the problem that we're having, one of the main complaints of the medical marijuana community is that the Department of Community Health, which is now um, being managed by the LARA um, in terms of the administration of the medical marijuana program, has been an absolute disaster. We're in our third year of the applications being sent to this department, and as of today, September 21st, their website reads that they are processing applications from mid-March. That's six months delayed that patients and caregivers have to wait to get their cards. This has been a major problem for the medical marijuana community. Many, many people are getting arrested because they don't have their cards. And even though the law states that your application, a patient or a caregiver's application, is deemed a valid registry card after 21 days, very few law enforcement officers are honoring that right and instead are arresting people. It's been very unfortunate. Many people have expected the promises of the government to get the cards out in time, and the cards to stand for the protections that are stated in the act actually apply.